Today, we're gonna to assess your muscular endurance. So what's the difference between muscular strength and endurance? A key determinant is duration. For endurance, we wanna see how long you can endure something. For instance, squats. Take your one rep max. You can squat 240 pounds. That's two plates on each side. Strip it down to about 75% of your one rep max. That would be about 180. That's a plate on each side and another 25 pounds on each side. If you can do that in good form for about eight to 10 reps, you're looking pretty good for muscular endurance. That's a good way to assess it. Another way, doing planks. Do a front plank. If you can hold that with good form for 30, preferably 60 seconds, you're in good shape there. For side planks, a little bit more challenging. If you could hold it for at least 45 seconds, that's a good determinant as well. You wanna to work to go beyond that because nobody wants to be average. There you go, pretty simple. It's nice to have these barometers to assess our progress because as you do progress, you're gonna be lifting heavier weights, you're gonna be doing dynamic exercises, plyometrics, athletic feats you thought never possible before you started this program. But as you keep progressing and growing, don't forget to come back and check in with all your postural assessments as well. Remember, go up the kinetic chain. Be cognizant of your form. How are your ankles and your ankle joints? Your knees? Are you experiencing any knock knee or bow leggedness? Are your hips all right? Do you have anterior pelvic tilt, flat back, kyphosis? You want to routinely check in because you don't want to pick up bad habits and get bad form, especially in the shoulders where there's a lot of people who have shoulder injuries because they get careless. They get the wrong form. They forget to pack their shoulders back and keep the right form as they do the movements. Don't let that happen to you. And lastly, your neck. Be good to your neck. Do those exercises, those simple exercises, and think about your posture and how you hold your neck when you walk through life. I love you.